Left, right, left, right, right, left, right. Left, right, left, right, right, left, right. Left, right, left, right. Right, left, right. Let's do it. Left. Right. Left. Right. Right. Left. Right. Please be correct. Awesome. still kind of got me. Hey, Mr. Church Grim, how you doing? Do I, do I unclose? Okay. What is, oh my god, it's the Church Grim's heart. Just like the encyclopedia says, and there behind the heart is the fucking universe. Oh, that's kind of cool. What do I do? Do I, oh, It explode. Oh. What now? Oh. Shit. Peer into the universe. Oh man. What is this? Also the church in blue, right? What am I supposed to do with this? Just spin it around? Maybe a hint. Oh yeah, I can still get a hint. Spin the triangle globe. Keep sp Oh, okay. I mean... I mean, I, I guess that's a simple thing to do, but I wasn't sure if there was like more to it than just spinning it and interacting with it. Oh yeah, this this is a uh, this is one of those games that you need to interact with. This is for like touch screens and stuff. After all, I I, I just said that earlier, but I already forgot about it. <laughs> okay, first it was the whole drill. Then I got the brook horse. Can't be changed. Oh, I think there's a certain sequence. One, one, two. Three, four, five, and six. Myling. The decision has already been made. Wrong way. Oh, 
Oh, go back and forth. Okay. This is really cool. I think this would have been really fun to play on, like, a tablet. Like alone in the dark before you go to bed? You must stop coming here. Oh, that's the church grim symbol. I'll just keep spinning it one way until it just dissolves into nothing. beginning of the game. She wasn't gonna marry us. Huh. So that's the truth, huh? Well, fuck. No map. Looks like winter has ended. Springtime is beautiful here. Or is this summer? Oh, there's a windmill off in the distance. The lack of music is really, really fitting right now. Oh, hello. You okay? Oh no. Oh no, she does love us. Was she saying that? Oh no. Oh, the chills, oh my god. What a reveal. So maybe those messages at the end, when we were like in outer space or something, she wasn't talking to us, our character. She was talking to her fiance, who, not fiance, she was saying that to the person who proposed to her. Because that person asked her to give her reply by the end of this year, and the end of the year was coming, it was in like in a day or something. So she must have said that she doesn't love them anymore, because she loves us. And they killed her? Fuck. This music's pretty great too, this is really nice. What a fun little game. This is great. This is really good. I really liked it. I still don't know what was in the box though. Thanks, Imogo. Good shit. Written it all down. Everything that happened. It can be changed, because that was our year walk, wasn't it? Yeah. We saw the future. Deliver the message to our lady friend. Save her life. The journal. The secret is hidden. Cool, there's a chance to see what's in the box. North of the mill. South of the brook. Remember? A secret. North of the mill, south of the brook. North of the mill, south of the brook. Walk again? Yeah! So it's not over? Cool, let's find out what's in that box. Okay, now we're back here. Same introduction as 
when the game started. I wonder if I can play with this yet. I don't know what this does. There's gotta be some kind of secret to it. Yeah, there's gotta be. I feel, uh, there's something in here. But whatever. It, the thing said that there is something north of the mill, south of the brook. We have no access to south of the brook yet. We can go north of the mill, but most likely once we get north, once we get to the mill, we'll have to find our lady friend and tell her what we know. I just kind of want to get there, see if we can save her. And here we are. I don't think there's anywhere else to go. Yeah. Hi. There you are. I've been waiting for you all day. Now look at that smile. You should not go outside without a hat on on a cold day like this. You would freeze your ears off. And I am quite fond of the person those ears belong to. Did anyone see you coming here? Now you're being silly, you know that I'm not ashamed of you. It's not that. I like you very much. But you and I come from different worlds. He is waiting for my answer. I said I'd give it to him next year. And this is the last day of this year. He's gonna kill you! Now you're being unfair, this isn't any easier for me. I like it when you're like this, calm down. You're walking, I hope you're joking. You do remember what happened to my cousin, don't you? Promise me you won't do anything foolish? We're not supposed to know what happens in the future. Well, I do. Are you serious? Okay, it's... This isn't a new game, is it? I'm playing the same game, right? Back to the cottage. I'm not sure if this is like a new game plus or a completely new game. What the hell is going on? But I'm gonna just keep on playing. Hopefully something happens. The only thing we have going for us is that I need to check north of the Windmill south of the brook for some kind of message, I guess. Or some kind of clue? I feel like it wouldn't be a clue because these areas are not ex- Oh, look at that! The... The... All... Hmm. The Ohm, 68, 1894. I'll write this down. Two entries into what I'm not exactly sure. But I did accidentally click this a second ago. Two entries, right? Could it actually be this? The... Wait, did I spell that right? Yeah. The Ohm. The Ohm. I don't know how to pronounce that. The Ohm 68. 19. Or 1894. Sign in. Oh, Theodore Almson. The. Theo Ohm 68. Wow. What is all of this shit? Wow. Is this every day? January 1st. Yeah, it looks like it might... Oh, it's not every day. It's nearly... Hello, new system. Testing photo upload. Should probably write here more often. Read about every book on Swedish folklore. There is surprised to how little has been written about your walking. Need more sources of information. These were his journal entries. 
Cool. Mmm, so this entire game was based on this person's research. That's cool, here's the motive behind the murder seems to have been jealousy. Apparently Stina was going to marry Lucas Tapper. She was on her way home from Lucas's parents when she was intercepted by Daniel. She was found the following morning, just 17 years old. Fuck. So this was based on a real story. Even the rune stone is kind of real. So whoever this Daniel Svensson did, or whoever this Daniel Svensson was, did indeed do a year walk. New Year's Eve, nineteen or 1893. Just so happens that our code is, uh, 1894. Dang. Or the password for this journal is 1894. Oh, here we go. Information about the box. I was about to give a woman old man. His aunt had lived there until the 60s. From then it had three different owners and used it as a summer house in the mid-80s. The last family that owned the cabin only stayed there one summer. Their five-year-old son drowned in a brook nearby, and after that they never returned. Nobody has lived there since. Whoa, the old man's nephew owned the land. I asked the old man if I could pay a visit. He did not think there could be anybody that would mind. Oh my god, this house, this cabin, that's our home. As the character? That's our home. Strange box. Are these things real? I'm starting to think that... The way he's framing his journal and the way he's, it's all too convenient. There's no way that this, the entirety of this game actually was based on like real life events. This is too crazy to be real. This could be made up. Yeah. No grave. Could not find Daniel's grave. Interesting. Hmm. <laughs> okay, I take it back. This game might actually be based on the events of this guy's research. That's crazy. That's crazy to me. This is too crazy to be real. This is too fascinating to be real. Crazy, crazy coincidence. Fiddle with the box, no clue to open it. Frustrating. I mean, he could have just made this box to take the photo to set this all up. Yeah. Okay. I want to believe this is true. Because if this is true, this man who was doing this research, oh, it started affecting his life. That's great. That's amazing. That's freaking amazing. 
Maybe that's why he included all these readings for us. I'm guessing the clues that we need to open up that box or in these documents, why else would there be a message in there? And the fact that he wants us to read through his thoughts means that he thinks his thoughts are actually really important. So maybe there is a shred of hope that this all might be true. There's a lot more of documents to go through though, like holy crap. No, this is getting a little weird. Yeah, okay, this is getting a little bit too weird. I feel like, okay, I'm sorry if I'm going a little bit too fast. I'm just going to leave all of this in as is. I'm not going to cut anything down. Um, I'm sorry if I'm going too fast. You guys can just pause it. I'm just skimming through these for any kind of information. But I feel like I'm getting the gist of the, uh, the thoughts in like one fast go. I'm probably going to have to come back and check out everything really carefully to figure out how to open up that box. I, I'm, I'm not believing this anymore. This is crazy. There's is no way that this could have actually happened. Well, actually, there, it's possible, but I feel like this journal is an elaborate, elaborate ruse to make the background of this game even more fascinating. Not only is the research that was done fascinating, but the events that led up to the game itself after the research was done is also fascinating. Man. To think a research project, oh, could make you uh, go through so much. Like he's going through a lot of shit here towards the end of this year. All right, the last one I woke up with this on my palm. Try to wash it out. It's a tattoo. No way. I'm asleep. I'll open that box up tomorrow. When the simple lines with the grim and the order that they were delivered to me. The order that they were delivered to me, but why was it empty? Hmm. Box unlocked it. Oh, oh, the rift is open. Oh my god, oh my god, we're gonna meet him. It's midnight and he's year walking. Are we the person doing the research? Wait, a okay, I'm gonna go through this journal one more time and then I'm gonna cut to us opening the box. I'm gonna figure out how to do it. This is crazy. There might be a chance that the researcher is reliving the life of the person he was researching. Okay, the first one is this triangle. The second one is this half circle here, then the square, then this triangle. And then the last one is the one that was tattooed on his hand. This one. What's in the box? The Dort murderer executed. Christian Stad, January 21st. Yesterday morning, the Dort killer Daniel Svenston was executed at 
Christianstad Prison, he was found guilty for the heinous murder of young Stina Nilsson last year. Nilsson. Wow. Does that have anything to do with one of these legends? I think it was... The Huldra? Was it? No. No, it wasn't the Huldra. Of course? Yeah. The little Nils, right? Oh no, I forget. I feel like I've seen this name in this game before. I'm... The death sentence has been criticized by the highly renowned Dr. Helmer Lundbach, who stated that Daniel is suffering from an abnormal psyche. He seems to have problems discerning past from present and has visions of terrible creatures. Oh, terrible creature is something not uncommon among schizophrenics. Daniel cannot be held accountable for his actions and should be given treatment at an institution for the criminally insane. The execution was performed by Gustav Dahlberg. This was his fourth execution. Last year he was to perform the execution of the notorious Lisa Ramuston, who was charged with the murder of four infants in Viddorp, but who took her own life before the sentence could be carried out. Four infants. She... Lisa Ramusen, you're the brook horse. Security has been improved greatly since. Daniel Svensson was composed during the whole process. Besides the slightly shaking hand so common among the criminal type, you could not tell Daniel from any other young men. He sobbed loudly once he laid his head down below, but quickly regained his composure. A quick prayer and a swift prow for stroke and it was over. According to the attending priest, Granath, Daniel's last words were, I should have killed myself, then none of this would have happened. You are long dead when I write this, and I have not yet been born. Yet we have a connection beyond life, death, space, and time. The impossible made possible by your walking. But... The Walters Wathers always win. Even though you've not passed through the rift yet, they sense the urge and they want their sacrifice. I wish there could be another way. I'm sorry. But for her, there is still hope. You can save her. You know what you must do. And even that was great all right that was an incredible experience and the reason why I think so is because that ending kind of threw me for a loop I was much more intricate than I thought it was like when I was playing it I thought we were just playing as some guy who was trying to do a year walk to figure out if um the girl he likes is going to end up marrying him or the, another person who proposed to her, right? And then at the end she ends up dead because the person who wanted to marry her was jealous of us because she was in love with us so that we can take that information and we can go and tell her about it and potentially save her life. But then I opened up that journal and basically what that journal was all about was the man who was researching year walking for this game, Theodore Almsdead, right? Theodore was like recording his experiences doing research for this game, and then he found the story of these three people. And it turns out that the love triangle was a real thing, it was a real occurrence, it really happened, and the the woman ended up being murdered, right? I was like, whoa, that's fucking mind blowing. And then bam, turns out that Almstead was reaching too far and he got too he got way too deep into this entire thing he got sent that weird box opened it up there was nothing and then he enters the rift or something and then he is the one doing the year walking so were we playing as Daniel or were we playing as Theodore I was sitting here for a second trying to figure out which what was what but Honestly, it might just be up to your interpretation. 
The dagger at the end had the initials D.S. Daniel Svensson? So, it was his knife. Oh, it's fucking... So open-ended. Oh, man. Well, I really, really like this short little beautiful art piece of a game. I hope you did too. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I'll catch all of you in the next game. Take it easy. Bye.